Helen. How can the how can the president justify spending billions for war and denying child health care expansion in this country where the needs are there? <laughs> well, um, I th there's obviously very two different issues. The president is for the expansion of the. Uh, state children's health insurance program. He wants to extend it by 20 percent for the next five years. Uh, there are those in Congress who want to extend, expand it even further. And um, what we see, we see that as um, a step towards more government-controlled health care. You're projecting into a future you're worried about socialized medicine. Mm -hmm. But why, what about the needs today of kids? Well, we, that's exactly what we want to do is to try to focus the program back to its original intent. Unfortunately, over the last several years, states have increased the number of people that uh, get the insurance that are well above 200 percent of the poverty level. We'd like to see the neediest children taken care of first. We believe our funding proposal is sufficient to cover the kids um, we expect to be covered uh, by SCHIP in the next five years. We would like to see the requirement that um, SCHIP go to the children who need it the most. And they took out, explicitly took out, a requirement that said that 95 percent of those children have to be taken care of first. The main principle that the president stands on is that the neediest children should be taken care of first. I would be surprised if the children who are outside today protesting knew that the president you know, is actually in favor of expanding SCHIP. And the principle he stands on is that the neediest children should be taken care of first. And I believe that other the children who are protesting today as part of that uh, demonstration would agree that the neediest children would need to be taken care of first. It. Dana, since you brought up the protest by the little kids out front in the little red wagons, <laughs> do you think by any chance that this would be considered political theater, as the White House has called uh, uh, some things in the past, political theater, this time to have the nation's littlest uh, children, the littlest people outside trying to send the president a message with something that they use to go to the playground. I, I don't know if de you know, the Democratic uh, leadership is going to have to square that with themselves. Um, I don't know, uh, maybe they got a pass out of school today to be able to come down, but I do believe that those children would have, uh, agree, would agree with the president that the neediest children should be taken care of first. Democrats say you're taking medical care away from children. Why can't he convince more of even his own party? Why does the health care industry support um, this bill? Why is the president um, facing so much opposition on this? Why, why were there overwhelming majorities in the House and Senate who disagree with him on this veto? And uh, why does public opinion think that uh, uh, expansion of this program is just... Well, I don't, know. I, don't, you know, I don't know about public opinion, and the president well, doesn't make decisions about... about the president doesn't make decisions based on those public opinion polls. And I think that it's incumbent upon us, and I appreciate this forum, to be able to explain what the president's position is to reach out to the children who need it most. This weekend, the New Yorker magazine came out with an article claiming that this summer the president, or at least the White House in general, asked the Joint Chiefs to redraw plans to attack Iran. Is that true? Look, you know, um, I, I'm glad you brought it up. Every two months or so, Cy Hirsch writes an article in the New Yorker magazine and CNN provides him a forum in which to talk about uh, his article and all the anonymous sources that are quoted in it. So the Look, the president has that. said that uh, he believes that there is a there is a diplomatic solution that we can use to solve the Iranian problem. And that's why we're working with our allies to get there. Uh, said before we went to Iraq, too. But what's the, can you answer actually, the substance of whether or not the White House asked, I mean, if it's not true, then you could say Cy Hirsch is wrong and CNN was wrong to air it. You could say that. But we don't discuss such things, Ed. We don't, ever, we we don't discuss through? such things. What we, what we have said and what we are working towards is a diplomatic solution in, in Iran. Uh, with the president has also said is that as a president, as a commander-in-chief, and any commander-in-chief would not take any option off the table. But the option that we are pursuing right now is diplomacy. But the article very specifically said that this summer in a video conference, secure video conference with Ambassador Crocker, <coughs> the president said that he was thinking about, quote, hitting Iran. Uh, and, I'm and not going to comment on a, I, one, I don't know. I, I, I wouldn't have been at, at any, at that type of a meeting. I don't know. I'm not going to comment on any possible, uh, an impossible scenario of, that an anonymous source, you know, continues to feed into Cy Hirsch. Why should it's anybody believe it. that the president wants a diplomatic solution? He said the that president before sought a diplomatic Iraq. solution in Iraq, and uh, Saddam Hussein defied the UN Security Council 17 times. So the history we've learned since suggests otherwise. That the president didn't. That, that Saddam Hussein defied 17 UN Security no. Council resolutions. The president was intent on <clears throat> going to war in Iraq, in any case. Now, the president pursued a diplomatic option. He went to the UN Security Council, and then we proceeded. Would he, consult, would he tell Congress before he attacked Iran? 
before it gets attacked to Iran. Um, we are pursuing a diplomatic solution with I'm Iran. You, does he feel committed to ask Congress for, for permission? We are, we are pursuing a diplomatic solution in Iran.